All right, everybody, we welcome you back to the second episode of Extra Butter. Uh, we've filmed 20 times. We've, <laughs> given, you, we've given you two. Uh, my name is Chris Trainer. I'm the staff writer here at uh, Free Times. Jordan Lawrence, I'm the music editor. And uh, we're back to talk a little bit more about movies and to uh, cast a shadow on, on the entire uh, industry of, of, of filmmaking. Uh, it's 4th of July weekend. It is. Well, not yet. It's going to be. It's going to be. When this hits the streets, and literally it's going to hit the streets, it's going to be hot as hell. But when this hits the streets, uh, it will be 4th of July weekend. We've got a couple movies coming out. Uh, Magic Mike, uh, Double XL, filmed in part in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. That's true. Uh, and then, of course, uh, the new Terminator, Terminator Genesis, the fifth Terminator film. Uh, Let's just jump right into that. What do you think of the idea that uh, they've made a fifth Terminator film uh, and what they're doing here with this? Uh, well, uh, the, the idea of a fifth one is fine by me. Sure. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's cool. I like Terminator movies. <laughs> um, uh, and I like the idea of I like the idea of the time travel aspect that they are tra- they they went with. Right. Um, I don't like anything else about what's happening with. Uh, I mean, particularly, like, they've already shown us the bad guy is John Connor, right. who is somehow half-human, half-robot in this weird disintegrating mummy kind of way, Nano, yeah. and uh, and is bad. The The guy that we've been trying to save all this time is bad, and Judgment Day is inevitable, and why, why are we doing this anymore? It's really sure. <laughs> well, we're doing this because someone's got yacht payments. <laughs> That's why we're doing this. Uh, it is kind of strange, isn't it, that... Uh, they gave away what seemed to be uh, such a spoiler in the trailers uh, that John Connor is, is is bad guy in this one. Yeah, I think I would have held that close to close to my vest. Was that kind of surprise you that they? Yeah, because literally the only thing that that move really has going for it is shock value, right? Like, right. I mean, it's I mean, up on the face of it, I can't see what else it would you know really do for you. It's what. And so in that case, what become what's important about protecting Sarah Connor? Like, what do you, what even is this movie about? If John Connor is the bad guy, why are Sarah Connor, Connor and Kyle Reese important to be saved? Because the only reason they were important to be saved originally was because John Connor is the savior of mankind. Sure. And Arnold now. Uh, obviously, they're doing a thing where there's an old Arnold and a young Arnold right. uh, you know, you, you know, uh, in, in this film. I've been waiting for you. Right. It always started interesting that, that the machine sent back through time a robot that has it speaks English in an Austrian accent. <laughs> Think about that. It's that more realistic. It's more realistic. <laughs> it is. I mean, everybody knows that everybody who comes back and you know totes guns and uh, you know dresses like a biker has an Austrian accent. But you know, exactly. He, did, he dresses as a biker because he comes and he beats up Bill Paxton right. in part one. And he, then they intentionally sent him back to another biker bar to yeah, start T2. There's symmetry in life. Isn't <laughs> and T3. And T3. It, was, it was a gay biker bar. Yeah, it does, it's, is it a coincidence that this weekend we have Magic Mike double XL <laughs> and then the original Terminator, you know, Arnie shows up beating up Bill Paxton, dick flopping around everywhere. Uh, but naked is symmetry. We all yeah. it all comes back to, 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 to the man meat. It's the sun. Anyway, thank you for watching Extra Butter. I'm Chris Trainer. Turn on. See ya. Peace. <laughs>